what is going on sheep army this is your boy random marks coming with a quick video and on this video guys we're going to be talking about what is going around in the shabarium ecosystem as well as what's going on in the sheep army guys so before i dive into it you already know what to do make sure you hit that like button hit that subscribe button definitely love to hear you guys' thoughts and opinion about shabarium like i mentioned in previous video guys my buying strategy is mine from support to support as it currently stands right now bone is currently sitting at 75 cents so the next entry point for me is going to be this 70 cents mark and if it continues to go past 70 cents then 60 cents so i like to buy it from support to support until i reach my 10,000 uh 10,000 bone mark so not a secret uh my welcome lower prices um but in the meantime, we continue to build the ecosystem in itself, Shabarium in itself. It is constantly building and we constantly getting uh, positive news. Like I mentioned, um, I think my last video about Bitcoin try, um, how they didn't list Bone, um, but they were given the support for Shabarium. I mentioned that I think Bone listing is going to come. And here you have it, guys. They are listing Bone on there because it, it only makes sense. If you're going to list a layer, you know, a layer two, then you got to have that native token on your project or else it's like, why even list it at all? So big shout out to them. There you have it right here. Bone is currently listed. Um, and here, how, this is how it is on their platform. You, as you can see, you could choose your network. You pick Shabarium ERC-20. So that means if you have bone and you want it to be on the layer two, if you didn't want to go to the little bridging process, you could just simply, you know, withdraw it out from their exchange, use this and just make sure it just goes to your wallet directly. So, again, small micro stuff is happening, guys, in the background. But it's good to be able to see that we're getting progress because some projects that's out right now, they're not getting any type of traction and little by little we're inching up so i'm happy to see like i mentioned i'm happy to see progress because again we're still in the bear market so once the bull market and we have all the infrastructure in place it's going to be a lot easier for people to be able to come on shibarium so yeah next thing up we have mars swap guys first shibarium project to be listed on a centralized exchange guys and when i say by first shibarium project i'm talking about a project that was uh exclusively built on shibarium first um and there is right here first shibarium token listed on yeah so exclusive because they was built on shibarium and now they got listed onto bit uh coin try so big shout out to them for that because i do see them they're constantly building and i want to see these project uh do well sharby six days guys six days away sharby is going to be launching on shabarium they have a pretty big community with over twenty thousand followers on twitter i'm not sure how much they have like on their telegram but if they have twenty thousand uh, on twitter i'm i'm assuming that their telegram might be massive as it currently stands, they're currently on Arbitrum as well as uh, Ethereum. Now they're going to also be on Shibarium. So they're going to be able to bring some type of volume, I'm assuming, um, at least from the initial uh, go up. Not sure what the community does or what uh, the token is all about, but I just know that they are launching uh, based upon uh, you know, what, they, what, what they've been saying. And they've been partnering up with a lot of other shibarium project is that too so definitely good to see and i mean my partner i'm talking about like collaboration and stuff like that it just in talks and uh so definitely good to see something like that next up guys and oh and before i go to the next thing now remember this guys builders on shibarium we haven't even scratched the surface as far as like project that said that they're going to build i know sharby was one of them so now we're starting to see a little bit of attraction guys little traction here little traction there then it's gonna end up becoming a big avalanche like uh, going straight down you know what i mean um so i'm definitely excited just to be able to see like projects from this list uh start to come on shibarium we have pause art they're gonna be launching um sometime uh this month as well they're an nft project um or marketplace 
Now, we do have Mantra as a currently stand. They are currently listed on Shibarium. Um, and the crazy thing about it, guys, I bought this uh, NFT uh, maybe like yesterday. I bought it for three bones, and I went ahead and flipped it for 5.5 bones. So, as you can see, it says yours because it's connected to my wallet. So, NFTs, it, it, it's kind of interesting just to be able to see like the NFT marketplace on Shibarium starting to blow up because, again, you have a lot of DGENs that would come, especially if the project starts to blow up. It it only just take one. And this is what I don't think people realize, like as far as like how these layer twos or even these um uh layer ones really exploded. Because a lot of time these, you know, starting off, it's very slow. You don't see that much traction when it comes to transaction. Then you get like a big massive project, just start going parabolic. It's going to attract eyes, so it's going to get people onto your platform because people are always looking for the next Sheeb, the next Pepe. They're always looking for the next token. So if Sharby explode, and I want it to explode because I know what it would actually do for the overall Shibarium network. So same thing with Paul's art. That's why I want this. And this is why I talk about some of these uh, projects that's on Shibarium because, again, it only takes one. Just like how we saw on uh, base, um, I think it was bald. It exploded. People made, you know, instant millionaire like overnight, like stories like that attract people onto their platform. And this is why you saw base explode the way that it did. Same thing for BRC 20 token, the Ordies. Um, people bought Ordies for 20 bucks and some people made hundreds of thousands of dollars based upon that so that attracted a lot of investors to come onto the scene so so shabarium is going to have the same thing hence why i am constantly just invested in some of these projects just to be able to put 20 bucks here 20 bucks there because you never know hey if i become a success story <laughs> i i guarantee you guys you're going to see a lot of people coming in as far as on uh shabarium so and not to mention, um, and I think this is going to be in play too, like as far as uh, incentive for people using Shibarium, I believe Treat is going to be a reward going forward in the future because it only makes sense. Because if you want people to use your platform, a lot of these layer ones, layer twos, they incentivize people. And I think the team are not dumb to the fact that, hey, that's what it may take. So. But yeah, guys, really, that's all I have for you today. Just wanted to drop these uh, little updates for you of what's going on in the Shibarium market. Um, yeah, I'm going to try to see if I could flip uh, some more of these NFTs, especially these uh, Shibarium board uh, <laughs> uh, ape or Shiba ape yacht club. So yeah, Random Arts guys signing off. Hopefully you have a wonderful rest of your day. Peace.